if I have the flu or COVID or what it is. Y'all, yesterday I was in the bed all day, like body aching, hurting, like I did not come out. I didn't see my kids yesterday. Um, two of them FaceTime me because they know usually I'm up and about and doing something. But y'all, I did not leave my room at all yesterday. I felt so bad. So, I called my manager yesterday and she was like, just go to the health center in the morning. Um, and then let me know what they say. And she called me this morning and checked on me. So, I'm on my way there to see what they say. And, um, yeah, that's basically it. Um, you couldn't tell me yesterday that it wasn't the flu or something because... Yeah, it was. It was something going on, definitely. But I'll keep y'all updated whenever I find out. And, yeah, so. First vlog of 2023. Y'all, I feel so much better than I did yesterday, I'm telling you. I do. I feel so much better. Because yesterday, I was, yeah. I'll be back here. My mama takes in the check on me. Well, your girl is in the room. Tested positive for COVID. So, yeah, I'm on the struggle bus right now. I don't work for five days. Um, I go back to work next Monday. Um, so, such is life. I'm, yeah, I'm going to be pretty much watching every movie on Tubi or wherever else. Right now, I'm just on my iPad playing a game. Stop up. I feel, I must say, I feel much better than I did yesterday. Because yesterday, it felt like everything was just, I thought I wasn't going to make it, y'all, yesterday. <laughs> And that's how I really knew it was more than a cold because my body was aching. I had fevers, chills. I couldn't stay warm. Um, all of that. So right now, I'm just in my room. I'm deep cleaning my bathroom, cleaning my room while I got a little bit of energy. You know, being that I'm just going to be in here, might as well clean um, in here. Y'all. <laughs> mentally I have to keep moving um I woke up this today I was like I just know that I'm gonna have a mess to clean up in the kitchen because Calvin made breakfast lunch and dinner yesterday and dessert last night um got up this morning before I left went to the kitchen to get a paper towel and the kitchen was spotless. The kitchen was spotless. The dining room was spotless. I was like, wait a minute. He cleaned up. Yeah, he cleaned up. He even cleaned up the living room, y'all. The living room. He did his thing. And I'm so appreciative to that. It's just the small things when you're feeling bad. Um, of course, I'm going to stay away from them. Um, wearing masks. Whenever I'm outside the room, which I'm trying not to go outside, but if I have to get me something to eat or something to drink, sanitizing, um, I got y'all, if y'all old here on the vlog, y'all know I keep a stock of Lysol. I probably have a hundred Lysol cans in my office, in my cabinet. Um, so right now I have some microband and some Lysol. I've been spraying throughout the house right now. Um, just got finished mopping and sweeping my bathroom and sweeping in here. Um, just washing my sheets and my spreads. So my sheets are ready. My spread is just drying. So, yeah. Because I felt bad um, the day before New Year's, I didn't get a chance to deep clean like I wanted in here. Um, I did a couple of things, but not really like I wanted to. So, I'm definitely going to do in my room while I'm in here. I'm just so thankful I feel better. Because yesterday, it was trying to take me out. Um, but I've been drinking hot, hot teas and, um, 
coffees and all of those sorts of things. And my good sis Angel from Angel Lifestyle told me to put some rubbing alcohol, the green one, in my bath water. And I don't know if that helped my body, but after I got out that tub of water, I felt so much better. My bones didn't feel like they did before because, yeah, I, I thought I was just not going to make it. Um, but I felt much better. And last night I slept under the covers and I woke up about three o'clock in the morning and it felt like something was crawling on my chest. So I jumped up and did like this. And y'all, I was drenched in sweat. It was like the sweat was just rolling off of me. And that's what actually woke me up. Um, so I was definitely sweating out. <laughs> so I just wanted to give y'all an update. Um, nobody else is in the house is feeling bad. Thank the Lord. Um, thank, I'm so thankful for that. Um, so yeah, I'll just be catching it, catching up with y'all periodically let y'all know um, what's been going on and how I'm feeling. Ain't nothing but these four walls, pretty much. But, yeah. Okay, y'all. I just wanted to share this with y'all while I'm down and on quarantine in my room. I did me a vision board, and I'm just, like, playing with it. Um, this was a pro, so I, I, I didn't want to buy it. I said, you know, it's just for me. But I do want to share it with y'all. Okay, so my vision board I created, um, and if you're wondering, I have it on my iPad stand, um, 2023, I plan to save more money, I plan to travel, I plan to get me a new truck, I plan to eat healthier, I plan to exercise, I plan to incorporate more romance in my life, okay, and what I mean by that, y'all know me and Calvin been married for 20 years, but <laughs> still in being married 20 years, I do stuff like date night, stuff like that, but I'm not like a big romance, touchy-feely type person, um, and I kind of like shy away from that, it's weird, but yeah, I'm working on that. Um, because I don't like to kiss and y'all see why? Cause I got sick from kissing, <laughs> but yeah, pretty much. I plan to bring more romance and ro more romantic romance in my life <laughs> with Calvin, of course. Um, I plan to pamper me more. Um, in the name of that, my sister booked me a massage. Um, well, I actually have to book it myself, but she actually set me up with a massage. So whenever I'm ready, I just make my appointment. So I plan to do more of that, getting my feet and nails done this year more. Um, and just pamper me um, so I feel good. And then YouTube. I definitely have YouTube goals of I get off a of quarantine tomorrow. I'm leaving Cal Calvin ass right in here by himself. No man, no sir. You gonna be right in here. <laughs> Y'all they got me working from home today. And, and this was Calvin. Really Calvin. Man, sit out for the police. They call the police on you. He look like you. You look like you over there saying help. <laughs> like you need some help. I don't have a call. You need three more days. Oh hell, I'm a fool. I'm still with you. I'm doing good. I'm getting out of here tomorrow. Uh, you. Hey, this is my, my people coming to get me tomorrow. Yo, you need to go down. I need to talk to the judge and let him know you need to stay a little bit longer. No, I don't. Look, you came too late. You came too late. You got to stay. I thought I heard somebody moving upstairs. I have not seen my kids since Tuesday. 
Monday or Tuesday. Um, they've been just dropping our food off at the door and then going back upstairs or whatever. Um, I did some order. I did an order delivery yesterday. <coughs> Still have a call. Um, got my sanitized wipes right here that I'm about to wipe now everything in the house. I'm making Calvin some beef stew. Um, his cough is worse than mine. <laughs> Not funny, but he has a continuous cough that he has to get rid of. I've been taking a lot of Robitussin. Um, if you find yourself in a position that you have the coughs from um, Corona or whatever, or a cold, Robitussin Max helped me tremendously. I'm going to share a little bit of what I'm doing today with y'all and hope that this brings y'all some entertainment. I hope y'all stay well. <laughs> So once the rice is done, then I can take that to him. But anyway, like I said, I just still got my mask on because I want to stay safe before I'm able to deep clean this house <laughs> and sanitize properly because I don't want no heebie-jeebies. And I was so happy to see that negative um, result. I do not want to see another positive ever again in life. Every time, all these days I feel like you need me. I break and I press. Do you ever think of me? Drought and famine, natural disasters. My baby has been around for me. Kingdoms have fallen, angels be calling. None of that could ever make me leave. Yeah. Every time I look into Shout out, Baby D. <laughs> nah, my sister Daya. She sent me $20 towards my um, care package. So I used it today in my Instacart delivery. I have, I ordered garlic bread, but they gave me um, cheese sticks, which is fine. Um, I needed two packs of cheese, one for spaghetti, one for tacos, hamburger meat, they substituted this um, when I did sharp cheese, but it's fine. I'll eventually use it. Good morning, Peyton. Some lettuce. I have some onions, some tacos, tomato soup, orange, Kool-Aid, spaghetti sauce, paper plate, sugar, Doritos, and bread.
going to eat lunch. Um, this is what I have. Tacos with some Mexican rice that I made. And then the punch Kool-Aid that I made. It's just um, orange with pineapple juice. Like I said, I meant to order a different kind, but that's what they substituted with, and that's what, what I'm gonna give it. But, I've done quite a bit of cleaning, and I feel like I'm backtracking, because you know when you cleaning, then you gotta cook. Then you gotta clean back up. So I just wanted to check in and let y'all know I did prepare lunch. And that's what I'm doing. So I'll talk to y'all a little later. I'm gonna watch some videos or something. Why is that nice? the video i'm tired um it's now 3 40 on saturday and i'm about to edit this video go take me a hot bubble bath and relax the rest of the afternoon um i'll be back to work on monday well i actually started back working thursday from home um she gave me the option of taking vacation days, but I decided that I would just muster up the energy and work from home so that I can um, keep my vacation time because I told y'all I got some plans for this coming year, um, some trips planned, my cousin's wedding, her bachelorette weekend, um, a trip that I'm doing with my family, um, I also got my grandbaby will be born this year. Um, so, you know, of course, I want to take a day or two off um, then to be there for my son and his girlfriend and the baby. So, and of course, you know, you know, to make sure I'm able to take time off whenever I need it. So, anyway, that's enough rambling. Um I'm excited. The gender reveal is this week. Um, so don't mind my hair because I'm taking this out um, to get my hair done for the gender reveal and all of those good things. So thank you so much for watching. And my next video, y'all may see, may be the gender reveal because, yeah, the struggle is real this week. Um, cause I got a lot of work to do at work. Um, because we have, I have not actually been in the office in a good two weeks. So with that being said, um, I know that the letters are piled up. Um, so we have to get those done and out the way and, and along with work, work. So that's what I'll be doing. So thank y'all so much for joining. If you have not already, click that subscribe button and become a part of the family. Um, so you can get more videos this year. Um, and I will see y'all. Oh, let me tell y'all this right quick. If y'all have not watched Imani on BET Plus, um, the movie, that's a good movie. If you have BET Plus, I really enjoyed it. 
Um, so I just want to share that. Every now and then I like to tell y'all if I see a movie that I really like, and that's one. Um, so thank y'all, and you have a great, great afternoon. I'll see y'all on the next vlog. Bye.